So first meal of the day is from Bex Prime. I got chicken breast, I think it's around seven ounces, baked potato with nothing on it, and a salad, no dressing. I think I smell like a tad bit of butter on the chicken breast, hoping not, but I'm gonna estimate just a little bit because it is from the outside, so I'm pretty sure they use oil or fats to cook it. So I'm gonna eat this up and go see a client. All right, so I estimated that there was about eight ounces of chicken here, which gives it about 11 fat, 45 carb. And I estimated the baked potato to be about 56 carbs. That's the baked potato. There is definitely butter or oil in that freaking chicken. Chicken fire though. Oh my God. Done. Done, done, done. <clears throat> I'm not eating that anymore. Chicken's done. Potatoes are done. You know what? So after even eating all of that food, I'm still really hungry. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, I don't know. But headed to see a client right now. And. I don't know, I might stop by that. Oh, actually, a client, well actually, he owns Fajita Pete's, so I might just go grab some food from there, but we will see. All right, I'm starving right now, guys. It is 3.45, and uh, I'm supposed to work out at 5.15 with Anderson. Haven't worked out with him in a long time, so I think we might be doing an edit. I'm not sure, uh, oops. And it probably won't be in this video because Anderson takes his time and, uh, you know, he puts a lot of work into the editing. So, that will not be in this video. Hopefully it will be, but if not, then you already know why. Um, but, I stopped by the convenience store to grab a Metrex. This is, these are so good, guys. So, this is a big 100 chocolate chip cookie dough bar. And if you have the carbs for this, I recommend like you try this. Or if you're bulking, like this is definitely a good bar. Um, but this bar's macros, super good. You'd be surprised. This is a big bar of chocolate chip cookie dough, right? Five fat only, five fat. 52 carb and 28 protein. So I know it's a lot of carbs, but it's a pretty big bar. And then, you know, super low fat in my opinion. So five fat, gonna eat this up. And then, uh, I might just chill at the gym. I don't know yet. So I should have filmed it, but I just took my first bite. Second bite. Fire. Oh my gosh. Definitely just heard one of those. Highly recommended. Hey, can I get a burrito bowl to go with a tortilla on the side? White rice. White rice. Charlie beans? Yes. Um, can I have sour cream and the corn Chicken, salad? medium salsa, just a little bit. And a little bit of sour cream. And that'd be it. Just got some Chipotle. Sadly, it's not for me. Got some for Jess. But, you know, I'm a good boyfriend like that. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, uh, headed to Jessica's house right now and she's gonna make me some food. So I decided, you know what? I'm gonna buy it. I'm in the corner, that's, my, that's my song right there. So, bought her some food just for a trade and she's not feeling so well, so you gotta treat the girlfriend, right? Look who that is. Look who that is she wants a chipotle that's why she opened the door a Jessica's about to make me some Kodiak cakes she got that new scale on deck what y'all know about this yo you got a discount code for this Ben? the scale yeah throwback thursday throwback thursday tbt yeah. all right so make sure y'all go to um the scale is too old.com and use code tbt and you will get <laughs> this for free 
Holla. Holla. What you about to make me know? You know I was coming over and you didn't have batteries for the scale. And my, my feeding window is closing very soon. Whoa, I'm sorry. You don't care about me. <laughs> Look at this fucking bougie ass. Well, it's not even bougie, but... <laughs> Old fashioned as fuck. When technology, <laughs> technology fails. So this is actually my second meal of the day. Uh, earlier I had that protein bar. And you know, that was just a snack before the gym because I was kind of hungry just to hold myself over. But right now I'm about to have, while Jessica makes the uh, protein pancakes, I'm gonna have uh, one serving of this peanut butter, extra, extra crunchy peanut butter, like the old school stuff. And uh, just to have my fats because I only have, including those Kodiak salad, I think I have like still 32 grams of fat. So I'm going to do that and then have the protein pancakes. All right, so I only have like 120 grams of protein, including this. So I'm gonna add some egg whites, uh, 150 grams, which is three servings. So the scale has to say 275. So 275 is where we're gonna get it. Three servings, perfect. Nice. nice. It's not that bad. bad. Yeah, this is just. I could. I just bring this everywhere I go. The scale. <laughs> like bring it to the restaurant. It's a commercial scale. FYI, my dad owned a restaurant. Yeah. All right. Let's see what he got. My aunt do all of it. Damn, that's a big ass pancake. It's gonna be huge. You realize how long that's gonna take to cook? Oh fuck. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta put a lid on that thing. Put a lid on it. Damn, babe. That's gonna be like this freaking thing. <laughs> the pancake's gonna blow up too. So, I am going to for syrup. I'm gonna use this Carrie's sugar-free syrup, and I'm probably gonna use all of it. Um, I'm not really gonna track it because I think this is only two servings, 12 carbs. And then instead of eating the peanut butter, I'm going to use all of it or the one whole serving and mix it with the syrup. I'm gonna heat up the syrup with the peanut butter as well. So I'm microwaving the sauce with the peanut butter, and so you know it's gonna be. Peanut butter is gonna melt, sauce is gonna be hot, and it can kind of uh, form into like a hot mixture. It's gonna be bomb. So that's how the sauce looks after you mix the peanut butter with the pancake syrup. I love eating pancakes like this, kind of dipping it instead of pouring it on top. All right, so I'm about to dethrone Russell with this pancake flipping challenge. Check out how big this pancake is. Look how massive that is. Ooh. All right, check this out. Damn, that's a little mess right there, but it's good. <laughs> that's good though. Damn! Yo, look at this pancake though. Look how freaking thick this is, guys. Perfect pancake. Damn. You could slap someone with this? It would hurt. <laughs> Let me slap you with this. Okay. You're probably so good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat this pancake. And instead of pouring the syrup on top, I'm gonna just dip it like this so I don't, you know, make it too dry. So, uh, I don't know if I can finish this. Honestly, like, I haven't been full in a very long time. So I really don't think this is like three servings. The scale might be wrong, I don't know. This is, this is, this is ridiculous, guys. I'm being challenged right now. I feel like I'm doing the 10K challenge. It's crazy. This is why intermittent fasting is so awesome. You just eat like super dense meals. You know, and you eat like, this is only my second meal of the day, so. If you guys are low in calories, intermittent fasting is definitely the way to go. Okay, so I'm gonna finish off my macros. Well, first of all, I couldn't, I couldn't eat all of this. Like there's definitely more than three servings. Cause usually I eat three servings and I'm fine. But today, not really. So I'm gonna finish off the protein um, with this. It's really good. Meta, Metabolt nutrition that they sent me a long time ago. It's just chocolate cake flavor. So I'm gonna eat, drink one scoop of this and probably conclude my macros. So I decided to give my macros to the babies because they're freaking so cute and they can have all my macros.
and it'll be fine. <laughs> you took my macros, man. You took my macros. You took my macros. All right, guys. So home now, and um, I don't think I finished my macros. To be honest, I was just so full I can't even eat, and my my feeding window closed. So that was pretty much it. So I'm going to. Well, I ate some Pringles. I didn't weigh it out. Just a little bit of Pringles because I had 20 fat left and a lot of carbs. So I ate a lot of it and didn't weigh it out. I want to say around one serving because I ate like 10 pieces. I'd say that's one serving. Um, so without the Pringles, my macros are as follows. 168 protein, 214 carb, um, and 40 fat. So, you know, my goal is 60 fat. Uh, 290 carb and 180 protein. So as you guys see, I was just a little bit under, but that's fine to be honest. Um, and that's why intermittent fasting is so awesome, guys. I, you know, it's not for everyone. Like a lot of people um, don't prefer it. And you know, this was my first time ever doing contest prep with it. Um, it's not going to be the entire contest prep, but you know, it's it's a, a good way to kind of train your mind for hunger and everything like that. So. You know, pretty much like I think next week I'm traveling to California, and uh, yeah, that's you know, so I'll probably be breaking my fast then because I'm also going to Thailand, and Thailand's cycle is completely different. Like the hours are flip flop, so that's not really gonna work out. Um, but yeah, everything's going pretty good. Hope you all enjoyed this video. I want to kind of stress that. Um, Intermittent fasting is awesome, and if you guys haven't tried it, um, I would definitely say give it a shot. It's definitely mental toughening, like for the mind in in terms of like hunger and everything like that. You learn to um, control it really, really well. And uh, I guess this is another way just to say that flexible dieting is fucking awesome, guys. It's so freaking good. Um, you can eat whatever you want, you know. As long as it fits in your macros and my rule of thumb for you know macro tracking and everything like that and flexible dieting is that um, get at least well the recommended dosage is one serving of fruits and vegetables per day I typically aim towards two um, but today that didn't really happen that's fine it's just one day because I ate out everything today um, everything was just from outside food sources as opposed to me cooking. So typically I eat two servings at least of fruits and vegetables per day. Um, that's definitely recommended. So yeah, that's pretty much it guys. I hope you all enjoyed this full day of eating on my intermittent fasting cut and uh, two meals total this day. So please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I got a freaking bandaid on my pink on my thumb. Um, and subscribe, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already done so. I will see you all next time.